so I have to get a car, right? And I am the type of person, I do not live in my car. So that I don't believe in spending house money for a car. A car is not an investment. A car is a, a something that gets you from day to day, one to one, whatever it is. And it it's that and it's a luxury thing. If you like a certain car or whatever, whatever. So right now, my dream car is what I have. And it's a Lexus RS350. Right. That's been my dream car. I got it, I think, 2016 or 17. But it's like seven or eight years old. No payment. Love my car. But my son needs a car. So uh, we either get a new car for him or get a new car for me. And he takes my car. But if I want another Lexus RS 350, it's going to be over $60,000 out the door. So I'm not willing to spend that money. So I've done some research and believe it or not, the BMW X3 is reasonable, cheaper than the Lexus. Most people would be like, wow, she drives a BMW. And I think that status wise, the BMW looks like you're wealthier more than the Lexus looks like you're wealthier wealthier but that's not why I'm getting a BMW I'm getting a BMW because it's going to be cheaper than the car that I actually want so that's why I'm getting the BMW so if I had a poverty mindset I would be like oh my gosh I'm not even going to look at the price of a BMW because the status of the BMW is like it's a BMW so I'm going to be like, oh, that's going to be out of my price range. Because I did think that after, for a while. But then I compared it. My friend got a BMW. I, I asked her how much she paid for it. I looked at the prices. I was like, wow, that's cheaper than the stuff that I'm looking at. How is this cheaper than this? I looked at her car. I love the car. It was a decent car. And it's $15,000 cheaper than the car that I actually want. So guess what? I'm getting a BMW. 